and by Carl, I mean Doc, you slash Don't Hazen Brown. think you can shelter him. Uh, and it's gone. Yeah, you just missed him. Young man, I've been sitting on the bench of Hill Valley Criminal Court for 15 years. I can smell hmm. a dissembler a mile away. Now, are you going to turn hey. him over, or will I have to use force? Don't antagonize Try. him. Well, if you're not going to say anything... So he is up there with you. Thanks a lot. Son, I order you to come down from there this second. Hmm. You oh, fuck dare sakes. to disobey a direct order? Emmett. I'm not talking to him. There's no point. Uh. So, what's your plan? I just stand here like this indefinitely. After a few centuries, mm. the process of petrification will set in, and that'll be that. Okay, that is a plan. It is. I'll be right back. <sighs> I want to speak to my son. Emmett's not ready to talk to you uh, directly. Nope. Oh, my God. I suppose you're his mouthpiece. I guess so. Yeah. Yeah. You can't talk him out of it. His mind is made up. No. So, yeah, if talking is. won't work, there's always threshing. If I can say so, sir, the problem is, is you're coming on too strong. You intimidate him. Yep. I don't intimidate him enough. That's the problem. Dick. Can you two have it out later? You mean after he's gone through with this ridiculous stunt? Yeah. Yes. No! Yeah. Stay right there. I'm not going anywhere. Fear! Yeah, I'm a fucking mediator Emmett, for this I'm not bullshit. talking to him. There's no point. Yeah. Just go deal with them. What have you got to lose? That's what they said to Custer. Okay, give me that Maybe one. Maybe he'll give you That's a fair true. chance to explain yourself. He is a judge, nope. after all. No. Yes, a judge who's already passed sentence. He won't listen to me. He never has. I'll be right back. Huh. Uh, for fuck's sakes. I gotta point every fucking thing out so, to these dumb sons of. Is your client prepared to make a statement? Uh. He says it's no use talking to you. You never listen. That only shows how pig-headed he is. Of course I listen. Mm. If he can justify his craziness, I'll be only too happy to indulge it. Stay right there. I don't think the fool. I'm going back and I'm forth. not talking to him. There's no point. Uh, you heard him. Yeah. He said he'll listen to you. Well, at least give it a shot. Uh, three, Father, two, son, one. You've never understood the first thing about me. All you want to do is step on me, squelch oh. my natural instincts. Understand. You don't know what it's like Let's to be young. Do you don't know what it's yeah, like here's to be young. God damn you, you are fucking idiots. You are fucking idiots. I should have squelched you. And it's all you can do to hang on for dear life while they got a point where they must. This is America, Pop. And in America, a person doesn't have to do what his father did. Isn't that why you came to America? To live where there wouldn't be so many rules? Huh. Well, we talked. Are you happy? No. But, uh, okay, I'm happy you talked, but Please. not that extent. You gotta get out of Emmett's way. I have yet to hear a compelling or even coherent reason why. Uh. Uh. Emmett's just... Stubborn, hey. willful, single-minded, incorrigible, and obsessed. Okay, but if you look at it from the right angle, those traits are kind of... Good. They're that good. may be your angle, Sonny, but I'm not so sure it's the right one. Make no mistake, huh. those are traits that lead to trouble. He gets them from his mother. Huh. See, Your Honor, it's just that this demo is so important to Emmett. <laughs> it is. A childish kerfuffle. He'll forget all about it in two weeks' time. That's what I'm afraid of. Look, Your Honor, you don't see it, but there's an awful lot riding on Emmett's demonstration. 
all the yes. more reason why I've got to put a stop to it. Look me in the eyes, young man. I expect you know my son pretty well by now. Do you seriously think his <clears throat> exhibition is going to be a success? Sure. Uh, sure it will. Ha! You know as well as I how it'll end. Disaster! Oh, for fuck's maybe. Sake. Maybe not. But even if it does, I mean, isn't Emmett entitled to make a few mistakes? Emmett has yeah, exceeded true. his quota for one lifetime. It's my job as his father wow, to see to asshole. it. Wow, what an asshole! There are no more mistakes. Okay, he's exceeded his quota. And it's just trying to make Quick. a name for himself. Maybe things were different when you were a kid, but nowadays you, yeah. you gotta take chances. What do you, you do. know about taking chances? Try moving to a strange country where you don't speak the language. There's only two dollars yeah. to your name. You? You wow. bet your socks, me! And I made out all right, too. How'd your dad hmm. feel about it at the time? Papa? He was fit to be tied. He called me a yep. disobedient little... So your father didn't approve ah. of you coming to America? Well, no. Papa never really understood the younger generation. He came around a bit in the end, but by then it was too late to... Tell him I'll listen to him. I want to listen to him. If he wants to talk. Yeah, and it talk to there, at least. Again, Pollyanna. Uh. Okay, so he's got a strong personality. Yeah, strong he does. Strong personality. Lord save us from strong fathers. Why couldn't <laughs> I have been born to a nice, wimpy milk toast? Yeah, well, that's no picnic either. The important thing is. Fathers can change. Says you. They can. I really think he means it this time. He won't listen to me. Huh. Okay, so he's got a strong personality. Strong personality. <laughs> Lord save us from one. strong fathers. Why couldn't uh. I have been born to a nice, wimpy milk toast? <laughs> Sorry about that, yeah, everyone. Well, that's no picnic yeah, either. Drink. The important Not thing is, coffee. fathers can change. Says you. Yep. Deep down, uh, he's just worried about you hurting yourself. No amount of yeah, physical pain could equal the pain he's already inflicted to my spirit. Huh. He says you get your what? stubbornness from your mother. Well, that's the limit. He's not satisfied with insulting me. He's got to drag my mother through the dirt, too. Mother isn't at all like me. She's gentle and sweet and endlessly patient. If anything, I'm yep. more like... Oh, skip it. Uh, you were starting to you say that say... you're like... Skip it. Can it be that you and your dad? No. Next subject. <laughs> Emmett, stop being nope. a dope. You've got your pride. Okay, I, I get it. And so yep. does he. But what's the harm in trying to make peace with the guy? He's your family. And That's family's true. important. Sometimes it's, family is well, important. even more important than we it's realize. Certain point, but family starts... Fucking with I you come up. <laughs> come on. Come up here, Dad. Uh, Emma's so, dad. You think my new invention is a disaster waiting to happen? Yes. Yes, I do. And I'm mm. here to say, if any son of mine is going to make of himself a public disaster, <laughs> I insist on being there to support him. Wait. 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 You're gonna change your tune once you see this baby go airborne. You see, the force field generated right. by the static accumulator. Marty, give Trixie the signal. We're ready for liftoff. Oh, good. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for bearing with us through that unavoidable delay. And now the Hill yeah. Valley Expo is pleased as punch to present Mr. Rivet Brown already and his what happened. electrokinetic levitator. It's gonna go bad. It's gonna get banned. This has been told already. We know this in advance because he told us. Oh, system, there I go. And away we go. Well, he's floating. He is flying, I tell you. He's flying. Yes. Yes. Sorry, I had to do the voice. I don't know why I had to do the voice. I. 
Nice job, Emmett. Emmett, that's Abby. That's good. That's good. That's good. We're both happy. Yeah, I play mediator. Going to the Lorian. What the fuck is going to go on now? <coughs> hey, we got an hey, stop. Get back here. Huh. Uh, what's going on? Uh, you okay? I thought I could change her. Things could be now. Nope. She's crazy. Forget about it. Come on. We gotta find a way to oh, stop her. She is great. Oh, a close. fucking crazy. Go away. Why are you oh. saying go away? Oh no. Well, Edna ran over Doc. Slash Edna Brown. Fucking Edna. She is fucking great and crazy. I keep fucking telling everyone this. Oh my god. What are they believe? Oh no! Why don't you believe me, Say everyone? Say something. Yeah, they said Edna is a great oh, a fucking loon. Potassium, potassium, yep. Iridium, titanium, ruthenium. Okay, I don't think you're talking about right now, Doc. I'm sure you, you will, speak. but still. What? What? You mean? Uh, you really gotta speak up, Doc. Fucking. Oh. Gonna get you to a hospital, Doc. You're gonna be okay. What the hell's going on in there? Yes. Oh. I think I am going to be okay, Marty. No, come on, Doc. Doc, what? don't do this. Don't Doc. Fuck. Uh, come back. Well, there goes the explosion like it was supposed to. Doc? Huh. Marty, have you been out here the whole time? Yep. Damn it. Um, is it over already? Oh, it's over, all right. Yep. You missed a very <laughs> wild party. I'm afraid I've been banned from the expo wild. for the next 50 years. And if I were you, I wouldn't go back in either. Really? At least not until all the broken glass is swept up. Oh. Did you read it? That was a glass. I'm thinking. Naturally, the ionic hmm. wind generated by an electromagnet of that size is going to play havoc with a merely mechanical steering mechanism. You yep. need a much more advanced control system. I wonder if we could find a way to translate the body's own gravitational field into electrokinetic force. One might be able well, to direct the ionic current simply by shifting one's weight. Oh, great, Scott! That's it. Yep. Uh, and you're you're not discouraged. I Discouraged? By what? Hmm. You mean what happened in there? That's oh, your point. That was what? a learning experience. But the way I see it, it's those happened. little mistakes along uh, the way that advance so us along the good. pathway of knowledge. Come on, there's no time yep. to lose. Let's get back to the lab and... I'm sorry, is something wrong? Uh, uh, excuse me? It's a long story. Let's just say I, uh, I lost somebody. Uh, yep. Oh, how sad. Anyone I know? Uh, boy, boy, boy. The uh, future mayor of Hill Valley. Strange, but how? Don't worry about it. It's got nothing to do with you. Yep. What? You're a complete what? mystery to me, Marty. Where you come from, what you're doing here. But there's one thing yep. I do know. Whatever it is, and it is... does have something to do with me. Uh, please, Emmett, don't ask What's any... What's this? Come on, let me see. I deserve an explanation. You do, but... Okay, here goes. What's that? An explanation. 
but you've got to promise me. Don't look at it mm. until you get the key to the city. Huh? Emmett! Just promise. Emmett, where are you, my son? I'll be right there, Pop. Key to the city? Promise? I don't understand. And you can't understand. Not for a long time. It would do irreparable damage to something. Just just say you promise. Yeah, just, just trust us. Okay, just promise. I promise. Good. Good. Huh. Wait. I will see you again, right? Of course. Guarantee it. Bye-bye. Oh, jeez. A lot of shit's happened. Now we said wait. What the hell? Leg. Ah. Can it be? Yeah, it worked. So, you were the same Marty. Funny how memory can yep. play tricks on a person. I remembered you being much taller. Uh, that's that was sweet. the ceremony. Long. You've got a theatrical way of sending messages. Yep. Only way I could do it without messing up your timeline. Very clever. That's true. What are you doing in 1931? It's a long story. Don't I know, trust me, Doc. 